Hey there, fellow Islanders, and welcome to this brand new video dev diary. Today, we're going to talk about update 0.10, the one that we've just released. It's called clever coding, but there is much more to it than just scripting in editor. Yes, there is. See for yourself. The main feature of this update is the visual scripting. But the first thing you'll probably notice when you open the editor is that it, well, looks different. We've changed the visuals to match the rest of the game. Most of the functionality remains the same, but there are already some improvements. Yeah, and we won't stop there. There are things planned for the future that will make the editor even better. But this update is not only about the visuals. Through the editor, you can access visual scripting. Every game object can have its own script and perform actions. And let's not forget about the powerful game logic objects that let you do so much more. With scripting, you can now use things like variables, perform operations with logical operands, strings, objects. Yeah, to give you some idea of how things work, we created three short uh, games that you can check out right now. And we are working on a wiki, which will contain a lot of useful information. Yes, so give the visual scripting a try and see for yourself how easy it is to create something cool. Do you feel lonely at times? Then get a pet. We are starting with flying ones. Some can be bought at our store, while others can be found in the game. Yes, they are just cosmetic objects, so they won't be able to help you with anything, but they are fun and you can get your first one just by completing the new tutorial. Alex has already mentioned that there is a new tutorial that ends with a nice reward. So, even if you know the game very well, it should definitely be worth trying it out. The vendors, in addition to other things, now sell bundles, large groups of stacked objects that will help you especially later in the game when you're building large structures and you don't want to spend a lot of time looking for basic resources. You might like to know that we are now fully moving into the polishing phase. As a result, We've already squashed some long-standing annoying bugs. To find out what bugs we fixed, what improvements we made, and what features we implemented, follow the link below this video that will take you to the changelog. Don't forget to let us know what you think, and we will see you in the next video. Bye. Bye.